Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and another episode of my Blasted Oasis series. It is the morning of day 68. We're just downstairs here. Uh, just decided to get a little bit done out here. I had a bit of extra time, so I got a bit of work done out here. Just cleaning stuff up. I didn't get any blocks fixed or anything like that. But I was knocking a few of those blocks out so we can replace them uh, with uh, proper blocks. So, uh, let's get back inside. Uh, I managed to pick up some more um, iron last night because we do need that. Uh, let's get our light back on here in a second. Not that. Guy's going there. So a screamer popped by last night, so I had to wipe her out. Uh, let's just put this away. So what I want to do, actually, is pull some of this stuff out because now these forges are clear again. I want to go ahead and do some of these. I'm uh, going to need... That's 2,000 iron. Yeah, let's get 1,000 in each of these. Get those started. And we're going to try the fusion forge out here in a second. Okay, so the fusion forge, kind of cool looking. I've decided to put it here for now. We need to get the same stuff in here as we had in everything else. Which I don't really have everything just yet. I mean, I could pull uh, the uh, one of the crucibles out of there, but we're not going to just yet. Not really worried about that. This, we're going to get some more... Uh, wait, do we need a crucible for the bullet tips? I guess I do. Crucible required. Uh, how long does it take to make a crucible? It takes a little bit of materials in here, but I think we can make it in the other workbench faster. 14 minutes. So forged iron, mechanical parts, stones, and clay. Easy enough. Uh, stones. We got the clay on us. Mechanical parts. Forged iron, which is here. Let's go ahead and make, uh, let's do it in here, because it's faster. Actually, they're both being used. That's making coil rounds. Shoot. Oh, this is done. Perfect. So, Crucible, let's make two of these guys. I can make five, but we're going to make two for now. Okay. Uh, so, we've been trying to keep up to date on our coil stuff now. So, I mean, it's not bad. That's why I need more casings, right? So, let's put you away that I need to make more forged iron which I can do in here let's make 250 in each of these so at least we have a stack of that extra and then we'll just leave the rest in here for now after all that I made the land claim block to put down at that fire station I forgot to do it yesterday no big deal. Uh, we're going back out today to go hit up some titanium. There's the uh, the uh, laser workbench. Can't use it for much right now. We got to get the laser multi tool uh, to be able to make the laser gear. So you need a, you need a laser multi tool to be able to make a laser multi tool. So you got to find one. So it's a bit of a pain in the ass, but we shall do, we shall find one sooner or later. Okay, so we got our stuff here. Let's put this down here and let's get out of here uh, we got our pickaxe on us it's a durability 1800 I guess we can get a uh, repair kit it's, we're better off repairing it here with another pickaxe but let's just take a repair kit with us I don't care I can always rebuild it later on where are you here Take a couple of those. Oh yeah, we want to put those uh, pills here because we don't need them now. Uh, anything else I need for over there? I don't think so. Uh, maybe we want to take... Depends on how we build the mine. Like I should put a turret up to kill screamers, right? So I'm going to need... 
some ammo. Do we have just a regular turret? We don't. I do have a power supply. Need a wire tool. I mean, we could take the Mark II turret and just bring it back, I guess. What does it take to make a turret and how long does it take? So, a regular turret. SMG auto turret. Motion sensor. It's 32 seconds. AK-47, rifle parts, pistol barrel, motion sensor, mechanical parts. I think we have all that stuff. Motion sensor. Pistol barrel, I believe. AK-47, auto rifle parts, AK-47 receiver, and mechanical parts, right? Yeah. Get one of those going. Put our uh, shotgun away now. Put that in there. Put these parts back. So we need a bit of take. Oops, we need to take a bit of gas. One engine is all we need. Um, I, I'm not sure how much it takes gas-wise, but this is like going to last us forever. So we're going to put an SMG turret up. We should probably make. Take some iron with us. Uh, hatch. Make an iron hatch. For that, then let's make some ladders. Uh, let's just get 10 for now. So we got this for the battery hook that up using the wire tool to the auto turret which we're, we've, we're, we're bringing out now with ammo in it got the gas we should have everything we need then all right let's get the hell out of here let's not die excuse me okay so we're just going to go to the edge of the wasteland biome rather than going in Fully. Gonna go to the edge, find a couple of boulders to hit up. Hopefully we find some titanium right away. And then we'll just start digging down. I'll put a hatch in, I'll put the turret up, and then, you know, if any screamers do come, the turret should take care of them. In theory. And it should kill any other any other wandering zombies, or at least most of them anyway. I hope. Oop, there's that bag we uh Produced yesterday. And nothing. Alright, here we go. Edge of the wasteland. I wonder if I should... I should have brought some materials. I made a base here. I'm gonna find a stone here to hit up. Okay. I doubt this has any. But we're gonna try it anyway. Yeah, it's just, uh, nothing. Ooh, the bag. What's up? Well, that's not bad. Let's grab both of those. Let me go over by that house. I mean, honestly, any base here wouldn't last long against the behemoth. But it's really not that, excuse me, it's really not that what we're looking to protect ourselves against. It's just the random zombies, right? It's a good place to just leave stuff. No, that's just got garbage. Okay, another boulder up here. This looks like it's right on the edge of the biome as well. That's coal. What about this guy over here? Probably going to be cool. It's like right on the inside, though. No oil shale. Let's break it down completely. Okay. Um, I'm probably going to have to go in. 
And we could try down here. Or well, we could go along here, I guess. Actually, did I see something down here? There's a boulder right there. And a dog. Nope, this is just garbage. Okay, well, keep on moving, I guess. Okay, got another one like right here. We're probably not going to get lucky. Yeah, not there. One over here. Got to murder that cop, I think. Well, maybe not. That's iron. Random garbage. That guy's looking for me. All right, what about over here? Nothing. Let's make our way back to that fire station then, I guess. Okay, here's one right by the road. Oh, that's, uh... that uranium? Plutonium. Okay, let's do this. See ya! Uh, we'll do... Say, waypoint X... Plutonium. Come back. I never put the brake on. That's my bad. Oh, one right here. That's garbage. Get rid of that. So I think you need both plutonium and, and uranium to make your ur enriched uranium, I believe, which is what you need to make laser stuff with, if I'm not mistaken. I probably am. Alright, this fucking thing. Okay, how can we do this? Let's, uh... I think the break is spacebar. But I think I've key mapped it to something else, so really is not going to work. Okay. Should just be able to... I hope this works. I don't know if I can do it with just frames, though. I think I might be able to. Right? Like, if we got enough frames... Nope, apparently not. Oh, wait, you know what? Uh, fuck this. Okay, I'm turning the stone I got into destroyed stone. Because I'm going to try and just build it up this way. The frames aren't going to work. This might work, though. Right, just enough to be able to, like, just drive over this area. Alright, is it perfect? No. Is it going to stop me from getting stuck? Probably not. But is it going to slow me down? I don't know. Maybe. Uh, how much can we more can we make here? Four more. Well, I don't know.
Yeah, I don't know. It's probably going to be really bad. Well, not as terrible as I thought it was going to be. The real trick's going to be see seeing how it is coming back. I'm going to park the car right here. We've got a thing here on the side of the road. Nope. Garbage. I'm way too far in. I didn't want to be this far in, but whatever. Hey, Mo. Ooh, we only got one of them. Okay, we got another one right here. Thank you. Man, these moms are upset. Why are you so mad? Oh. All right, we got the gun out. I was hoping to stay quiet. But that's not going to happen now. I want to check this boulder out. I think we can beat the shit out of Mo. Dude, just stay down. Okay, let's grab this. Nope. Okay, we got one up here. Two up here. Iron and garbage. I mean, I guess we could just like dig a tunnel straight until we come across it like you would do in Minecraft, but that just seems like a waste a waste of time. Kind of like what we're doing right now, wasting time. That's a big football player. Not as big as my car. Oh, we got two right here. Let's hope for one of these suckers to be good. Nope. This one will probably be garbage too. Nope, that, there it is, titanium. All right. There we go. All right, now, how are we going to get down to it, though? I think I want to stay right... Let's go right in here. So what I'm going to do... Open this up a little bit. Okay, open this up. I want to have it right in the side of the road here. Then what we'll do... Okay, we want to build... I need another hatch. Do we have enough iron for that? We do. Craft an iron hatch, because we want to do... This. That. We want to put our generator bank in there. Drop our motor in. So this turret I think goes there. Then we put that down there. Right? 
And then we go ahead and put... Where are you here? Connect that. My question now is, will the generator, generator running generate enough noise that it's going to cause zombies to come? That's a good question. Let's turn it on and find out. Yeah, that's probably from the gunfire, though. Probably from the gunfire. Okay, it's all quiet. All right, let's do this. Now, we need to dig out a 9x9. Nine nine. Oh, it was a bird. Nice. Well, at least we know it's working. Gotta take this piece of the road out, I guess. Okay, so we do... Ah, we're not on a... F I guess we have to go... This way. Right? Three. That. 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 Then... Gotta do that too, but we'll fill this in. Yeah, I should have brought cobble. I guess I can make it. I'm just really hoping that this uh, turret does a number on any zombies. I don't have to worry about them. That's stone. There we go. So we do come on where's the cobblestone starts with a C fuck it just make it all okay now we got our ladders down and then theoretically when you put in oops not this this it should automatically open away from you Right, perfect. Excellent. Give this a bit of reinforcement. Not going to be much, but it'll be something. And then we just dig down. Test it out on this chick here. No, I say we kill her. Okay, well, let's make sure the rest of these are updated up here. Oh, you didn't die. Okay. That's gonna work. Yeah, it's going to work. Alright, let's get in the hole. And hope really nasty shit doesn't show up. There's the titanium we're looking for. Alright, we're mining. Alright, well we picked up a little over 8,000. I think that'll probably be fine for now. I just want to see... Oops, how much is going to cost to make stuff with this? So most likely... Let's do this. Uh, let's do that for now. 
Actually, let's put it on this side. We kind of know where it is, but it's not going to be in the way of the gun. All right, so um, I have no idea how much it's going to cost to upgrade the blocks. Like, I think we have to refine the titanium. So we're going to go back and do that now. I'm interested to see. Don't oh, destroy the gun. Interested to see how much um, we can get with that. All right, let's see how our bridge does now. We're probably going to plow straight into something, but... Oh, that's actually not bad. If I hit it kind of at a weird angle... Perfect. So that's, uh, that mine's a little farther in than I wanted. So we might look around here a little later to see if we can find uh, another place to dig. But I think that's not that bad. I mean, it's on the way to, to both the traders, like both the Caitlins. Whoa! Could keep it on the road. It's on the way to both the Caitlins. So, I mean, it's like it'll be one of those things where we go to do a trader run. We'll stop there and pick up a bunch of uh, titanium on the way or on the way back one of the two like I could uh, save the trader run for later in the day we go out there and do the trading and the episode and then on my way back I just go there at night time and just spend the night digging although I don't know it could get real crazy all right that's not bad we have anything here we need to bring in uh, nope it's fine Okay, let's get right upstairs. I gotta, get, uh, I gotta work on this tonight. I think tomorrow, we're gonna spend the day tomorrow working on um, getting the horde base repaired and up and running so we're ready for the horde night. I wanna see if I can get at least that plate around there, like the sides and above the door, like the plates and the block on the inside all updated to uh, forge titanium. Cause if we get one of those um, behemoths up there again, we got to rip him down fast before he's uh, able to get through that these blocks. So we'll do that. I wish I could make titanium hatches, but I don't think that's an option. All right, uh, what do we need to do here? Let's grab... Do we need clay? Do I? I don't know. Let's find out. Uh, titanium. Oh, I probably won't be able to... Oh. Can make titanium out of titanium. Forge titanium. We need two clay and 20 titanium. This will give me 400. So I guess that's not bad. It depends on how much it's, it's going to take to upgrade, right? Put one crucible in here. Put one in here. Okay, so. Uh, forge tit. Uh, let's see what we got here. 409. Let's just do 400. What else can we make it? Titanium bars. I'm guessing you can update titanium arrows, titanium boots. I guess that's the power armor. Well, let's get that started. 37 minutes. That's, I guess, not too bad for 400. I mean, if we can get a few more fusion forges, we should make some more money between now and the next... Uh, yeah, between now and the next... Like, not this horde night coming up, but day 77 horde. We can get a couple of these things running with just making titanium. Get the base updated to titanium. Although I should probably get... So the casings are all done. How much iron do I have here? I'm going to need way more steel. So let's grab that out of there. Let's see how much steel we can make. A thousand. So let's make 250 in here. We'll have two more stacks of steel. Before the horde. Craft. And get that going in there. Okay. So two more stacks of steel. How much do we got a bit of concrete running in here too? Don't need concrete as much as we do steel. Uh, so this stuff can go in there. That can go in there. Cobble can go in there. Okay, so... We've got three, four, five and a bit stacks of steel. I did make 
forge iron in here, so we'll have some iron if we need it. Okay, not bad. So I guess we need what we really need to do then is tomorrow. That I gotta take out. Let's make a couple thousand more rounds. I need lead. Or do I? No. Coil rounds. Perfect. So we got a shit ton of coil rounds now. Excuse me. Uh, not that. This. So what are we looking at here? Yeah, twenty, almost 2,500 in there, and we've got 1,200 on us, plus another 2,000. So we should have plenty for Horde Knight. We'll just use, I think we'll use the coil guns on Horde from now on. The M4s, sorry to say, might end up being just going on the wayside, although I might load it up with AP 7.62 and just have it as a backup. But I think the coil guns need to be the, the primary, primary weapons. All right. Put this stuff away. And you guys can go in here. Oops. So that goes in there. We can put you in there for now and you. Okay, we got 483 pages, so we're pretty close to be get, being able to get another um, book. Oh, well, I guess we're about halfway there. So that might have to be a priority. All right, let's just, while we're here, we got a little bit of time left in today. So we need to steal concrete. We need some of you guys. Let's just get that down there. We'll fix those blocks up so at least it's repaired. And it's got time to dry before we're ready to update. It's just the one I think we lost. Which is actually not that bad, considering... Okay, get that done, and then we'll do under here. I think both of these just probably will be fine with reinforced. If they somehow blow through under here, we'll figure it out later. Get that filled in. And then over here, working on getting this stuff all done. So, did we get underneath there? We did not. I think we'll be fine. Yeah, I'm going to work on getting all this stuff done, too, at some point. Ah, uh, so much work to do! Like, they've... They did a number on this, too. They're just pissed because they fall off. And they can't get to me, right? So they spend time down here banging on shit. At least it's, like, super solid. Yeah, I mean... Overall, the damage isn't that bad. So I actually might just spend tonight. I should really break these out of here. We'll wait till they break them out of there, I guess. Yeah, they don't even touch down here. But they spend their time on the front. I, I can't, this is still not dry yet. I could still, I just can't foresee them ever breaking this block down here underneath me, but it really depends on what kind of mobs they get. Like if it's like several behemoths and they decide they're just going to wail on that all night. You know, they might be able to take it down because they broke through that one, uh, the hatch at the front there pretty quickly. I think I'm going to have to like not be shooting down here too, because I think a lot of the uh, coil rounds are armor piercing. So it'll go through them and into the base. I do damage. It'll do more damage down here. Like, I'll do more damage down here than they will. So I just have to wait for them to come up, I think. Alright, well, there's Nightfall. I'm going to keep working on getting this base repaired. Maybe we don't spend a lot of time here tomorrow. Nah, I want to see how that Forged Titanium is going to work. I got to get that sorted out first just to make sure that it's working properly. But 
I'm going to end the episode here, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, drop a like. If you haven't subscribed, please feel free to subscribe. And drop any comments in the comment section down below. Until next time, we'll see you later.